Uh, Makasa family is devastated after police arrived at their home and began excavation, excavations. They were searching for the remains of Dennis Margaret, Denise Margaret Kutsia, who was reported missing on the 22nd of September in 2010. While no remains were found on the premises, stories started spreading on social media speculating who the murderer could be. A fake picture of the remains of Denise was also circulated. ENCS Nobisutu Hejana is now following that story for us and she joins us live. Nobisutu, such a bizarre and devastating story for that family having reported their mother missing. You cannot imagine the emotions they're going through 12 years not knowing where she is and suddenly police come and this, they search their home. Certainly, Maseho. In fact, Denise, when she went missing, uh, she was 50 years old, and Kharika says she would have turned 62 this year. Uh, they've been looking for her. It's been 12 years now with no lead or information from the police, but she says when she was called by neighbors last week when police were here um, excavating the backyard in hopes of finding her remains, she was shocked to learn that there were actually pictures of um, a dead person on social media that was circulating, people believing that it was indeed Miss Denise Kutsia. But she says as the family, they're very distraught and having police being here and uh, with them feeling that uh, her father was being accused of killing her mother, uh, it brought back memories and they are still distraught by those events and she says um, it has left the family in such a panic uh, with her father who is now left for Hermanus because he feels that uh, the community members are uh, insinuating that he might have something to do with the disappearance of Denise and she was also showing us uh, the search warrant that was brought here where it clearly stated that police were looking for body parts of Denise could see her, and also weapons that might have been used uh, to kill her or anything that would um, uh, link her to the, her disappearance. So the community activist or a member of the um, community policing forum, sorry, that we spoke to also earlier on, he was telling us that uh, he wants those behind those Facebook page to take responsibility because if it wasn't those people who posted fake pictures, um, people would have not come here and in fact police would have also not come here because there was no proof that any of those pictures were of Ms. Denise Kutsia. So he was t telling us that uh, people need to refrain from posting things that aren't verified because they are putting other people at risk as, Deni as um, her daughter was telling us that it would have been uh, um, the family feels uncomfortable being here. Mm. I was actually going to ask you about how they were able to cope, uh, Nobesutu, but thank you very much. Let's leave it there for now. She is in Makasa uh, for us in Cape Town.